This spring has been especially beautiful after this winter's brutal storm. Of course, it wouldn't be spring in Texas without our blue bonnets. Our folks in our uh, Facebook page, WFA's Through Your Lens, have snapped some breathtaking photos along with many of our other viewers on social media. You know, those blue bonnets, they're not going to be here much longer. So while we can, let's celebrate our state flower. Lupinus texensis, the Texas blue bonnet. An annual rite of spring found everywhere, running alongside roadways, blooming in backyards, or dotting the meadows along the Blackland Prairie. The famed flower is as much a part of the Lone Star landscape as longhorns and sunsets. Whether paired with paintbrushes or flying solo, blue bonnets form the backdrop for countless pictures and family photos, postcards that remind us of a simple breeze and a Texas sky that extends as far as the eye can see. Legendary, mythical even, the rumored law against picking blue bonnets is just a Texan tall tale, but why would anybody want to? and rob others of this purple-hued blue beauty. The earth spins, the seasons change, and the blue bonnets put on their annual display before soon saying goodbye. Thanks for the visit. We'll see you down the road. I mean, those pictures Beautiful. are stunning. And by the way, my apologies to some of the folks in that Facebook group that I wasn't able to use all of the pictures. Right. There were so many, and we've gotten so many more this morning. You folks have been sitting in, <laughs> we've asked you for them. Trish and Witherwings, Wither shares Wings. this picture. Oliver Nature bonnets. Park. Beautiful. Joanna, I am up. Oh, this was so beautiful, Joanna. Thank you for tweeting us this morning. She said someone saw her, her dog out there and was like, is that a polar bear? A little girl <laughs> said to her mom. <laughs> That's a big dog. <laughs> Stephanie shared this picture of Tucker in the blue bonnets. A lot of oh, dog Tucker. pictures, a lot of Tucker family pictures. Mad. Folks heading out there like this one from Lori. Lori. This is Rue. Tata Nisha, her daughter Taryn enjoying the blue bonnies at blue bonnies blue bonnets <laughs> at age three. This was her on Easter Sunday. Ooh, I remember Too those dresses. Cute. That's right. <laughs> and how about this one from uh, our very own yes. Kelly Napier sharing this photo? A uh, lovely single. Is there a way to take a bad picture of a blue bonnet? I, I don't, don't think, think so. Thank so. you, Don Wagner, right. for this one. You don't even need Mark's camera skills to take <laughs> pictures of blue <laughs> that bonnets. That is the truth. What Lori sharing here? Here is our favorite large puppy, Mr. Blue Bonnies in Fort Worth, Funky Town. Thank you, Lori. Yeah, and, uh, you it. mentioned not being able. We'll see him. I, I ain't know seen not a one blue bunny. There aren't as many along the freeways here in, in uh, DFW, but if you get outside, I was in Parker County yesterday yeah. mm -hmm. and on 20 on the way to Weatherford and to, to uh, Ennis Brock. as well. How you don't know? How you so know how many. to get out of Dallas? You just keep driving. Mm -hmm. You just keep driving. We'll, we'll figure it out. <laughs> I heard they got something down in Duncanville, by the way. Yeah, maybe I go out south and talk to my friends in Duncanville. All right, we're gonna be live. On